Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode. I'm indoors right now because it is a little windy outside. It is late in the day, so I do apologize. The lighting in here just kind of sucks, so I do apologize. Hope this video comes out okay. Uh, my daughter's a little cranky. She's ready for to take a nap. Uh, <laughs> So she's ready for to take a nap. So we're, we're going to be doing the giveaway right now immediately. Just so, much, so I could give the, the phone to my daughter and she can start playing. Uh, so we're going to be doing the giveaway for last week. Um, and here we go guys. Push the button. So this is for the sponge filter. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Let it go. Alright guys. So this is for the sponge filter for last week. Let's see who wins it. Amy Tellier, congratulations! Yay. Congratulations, you won the sponge filter. And my daughter wants the phone to play. Here you go. <laughs> Told you guys, guys, she's ready to take a nap, so I just, I'm trying to hurry up and do that. All right, guys, so we have four sponge filters to give away. And Sharon Kim still hasn't contacted me. Sorry about that, this chair is, that I'm on is a really bad chair. <laughs> So Sharon Kim still hasn't contacted me about um, last week's giveaway. So I'm going to shoot her another message and hopefully she contacts me. Um, and that'll be hers. This one is for Amy because she won today. And then after that we're only going to have two more sponge filters to give away. So next week we're going to be giving another, away another sponge filter. And then we got one left after that. So two more after today guys. Let me see, let's see what we could talk about right now and try to try to update you guys a little bit on my on my tank since you guys haven't really seen them. Um, this is my daughter's play area and this is where I do keep uh, a couple of, couple of my tanks. So this is my shrimp tank um, and they're doing okay. I don't know if you guys can kind of see my shrimp back there. Um, to tell you guys the truth, I really don't know how many shrimp are in here. I do know that they are breeding. I do know that there's a couple of babies in here. Um, I've seen them around. I'm pretty sure if I didn't have any guppies in here, I probably would have more um, more shrimp. But so far, I think I have I have a, a decent amount of shrimp in here. I do have three male guppies and two uh, little uh, unsexable, or three of them, I think, unsexable um, guppies that I still don't know if they're males or females. Uh, so I think eventually I'm just gonna keep uh, three males in here, maybe just two. I do like the guppy, uh, the guppies in here swimming around. Uh, one other thing that I probably need to add in here is probably some driftwood. I do have the almond leaves back there. Sorry, but <laughs> I do have the almond leaves back there um, for the shrimp. Over here is my beta tank, and this is the only tank that I'm really, really struggling with right now. I don't really like it. Um, it's got white sand and it is a pain in the butt to clean. Um, this light is really, really, um, really, really good. It, it's kind of proving me wrong, uh, but it is, it's growing a ton of algae. Um, I did put two guppies in here just to see what he would do because I do feel bad that he's by himself. Um, you're, you're not supposed to keep um, other fish with betas, that's what they say, but so far he doesn't seem to care. Um, I think he likes the company. Um, at the beginning he was a little bit like kind of freaked out. He didn't know what was going on um, And the guppies were kind of freaked out, but look at him um, He's right there. The two little guppies are over here and nothing seems to happen. So um, He doesn't really seem to care. So I do like the fact that That he's kind of um, kind of enjoying their company or or probably just doesn't care Another thing that I don't like about this is that I have the sponge filter over here and it kind of splatters so this side of the tank is really 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 bad so I am going to redo this tank eventually uh, just not right now once I move I'm going to re, re aquascape this tank um, I think I'm going to go full planted I think right now I only have this um, this Anubius in here and like I said it's just it, it was a good idea when I set it up um, I enjoyed it the first couple weeks but Keeping it clean has been a real, real task. Um, so I really, really do not like this tank. I'm gonna redo it. Um, he's got some almond leaves back there. You wanna go out? So 
so he's got some almond leaves in there that he put he goes in in between I kind of made a cave of almond leaves and he really seems to enjoy that but that's that for those right now there isn't really too much of, I could really update you guys on that let me see like I said the lighting in here just is horrible I think I one of my worst videos probably <laughs> all right guys so check this out I just got this for my vendor uh, this was from week one the winner of the t-shirt I finally got it back um, I can't really do this with one hand but check that out we got the goldfish um, now for next week I'm thinking of doing um, I know I thought about I told you guys that I was gonna do a giveaway for some a shirt that somebody gave me uh, but I think I'm gonna hold off until the end for that one uh, seeing how it's Christmas next week I decided to do another round of t-shirts um, so I'm gonna do another World Pet TV t-shirt. You'll have the option of either doing the goldfish one, which is pretty cool, or you know, you could do this one, which has a reptile, has an iguana. Um, I really dig this one. This one, um, I take it to the reptile shows. Uh, whenever I do go to a reptile show because it's got the iguana, it looks pretty cool. And if you're a guy and you don't really wanna rock a goldfish in public, I mean, I do. <laughs> <laughs> but if you don't want to rock a goldfish in public uh, you can rock the iguana so I'll let you choose uh, which one you want if you want the goldfish or if you want the iguana um, nevertheless we're gonna do that for next week so next week it'll be a t-shirt and it'll be a sponge filter so hope you guys are enjoying this episode guys um, that's it I'm trying to make this as short as possible congratulations Amy on winning the sponge filter um, I'll, uh, send me an email and I'll send you the, fi the filter so I don't know what I'm saying <laughs> it's, late. it's late and I need to get this video out so all right guys so like I said next week you guys know the, you guys know the the routine uh, just put both in the bottoms if you qualify um, if not just put whichever you like to, um, to win so uh, world pets TV t-shirt and um, sponge filter um, I think somebody asked me about the turtle. I was trying to get the turtle out today I was actually well, I wanted to film outside and give you guys an update about the turtle because somebody wanted to wanted to see it so um, He was it's cold outside. He was inside his house uh, warming up So hopefully in the hopefully this week on uh, this weekend. I'll do an update on the turtle Maybe I'll have it Saturday and I'll show you guys uh, the Sakata tortoise um, Like I said, I was trying to do this today, but it's really windy. It's really bad outside I'm indoors. I need to get this video out to you guys. Hope you guys have a great week. Talk to you guys soon. Have a great day, guys.